hi gemini welcome back to i enigma this is enigma we're going to do your 2023 read this is going to be a general reading so take what resonate and leave what does not resonate for more personals i'm available on whatsapp instagram or email details are mentioned down below you can also reach out for white prairie based spells and manifestation crystals intention charged pure crystals do subscribe to this channel for more videos on your sign and my Scorpio channel if you are dealing with a Scorpio or yourself are Sun, Moon, Rising or Venus in Scorpio or Mercury in Scorpio. <clears throat> Follow my Instagram for upcoming January free predictions and happy, happy new year each and every one here, Gemini. Let's see the messages for you. 2023. For my Geminians, okay. Oh, okay. All right. The treasure is all yours, Muse of Materials. In the end, let's start. Hmm. this and what I'm seeing over here at the bottom of the deck is muse of materials and then we have the seven of materials Gemini you guys are going to prosper there's no doubt to it you guys are heavily heavily manifesting wealth but the best part is that it's just not coming alone it's coming along with new love okay what I'm seeing is that you've been tired of dating all the wrong people or you've been tired of not finding the one. Even though the people are interested in you, you have options coming in, but they just don't somehow come into fruition because you don't feel that this is safe or you don't feel that this is coming from the genuine source or someone is coming from genuine feelings. So you kind of... Uh, letting go of all of this mess that's related to your relationships in your life and you want to just focus on one person <clears throat> and you're willing to wait as long as it takes okay but the best part is you're about to meet someone while you're on the roll in your in your career while you're working on your profession your goals your money matters i'm seeing maybe you might fall in love with the person that you're working with okay i'm seeing the ace of emotions is more about ace of cups which is new beginning where you're going to be meeting someone specific that one person that's going to change or shift the whole dynamic of your perception towards relationships because Right now, till now, you might have thought of dating or meeting some people, but not sure of uh, getting down with anyone. But now things are changing because the one person that comes into your life is going to stick around. Okay, That person is going to be your dream person. That's, that's the person that inspires you because you're someone that's a strong-headed person and has big ambitions and goals in your mind. And when you meet someone like that, that's already placed there and has achieved a lot and uh, is a leader, is a boss, it makes you feel proud of being known by that person or being dating that person. I feel that is something that's going to open up your heart in such a way that you will be interested in taking things forward with this person i'm sensing the one that's coming into your life i was getting this in the earlier read as well that 2023 is going to be with this one specific person with whom the money is something that you guys will be uh, like uh, sharing based on the status thing i feel like you guys are pretty much on the similar status this person is way beyond your status. I know that you're doing really well. You have good money, but your person is like double and triple of it. And they are <clears throat> much more in this field way before you. Okay. This person is much more experienced. 
I'm seeing that this connection requires patience. This connection requires understanding, mutual understanding. And I feel there will be shift in the dynamic of this connection once you guys get involved with each other. This is someone that's coming from a place of sense of security, wisdom, maturity, groundedness. But they're also very protective of the ones they love. They will be protective over you. I feel you're attracting someone that's an alpha figure. That's an alpha male or alpha female or whatever the gender may be, it doesn't matter. This person is a leader in their field. And when you meet them, you'll be like, okay, this is the one I was looking for, okay? I'm sensing they have good money and uh, they've achieved a lot in their life and they're pretty stable. And you guys, I feel like with this person, you guys may learn a lot of new different skills, okay? Um, you guys are gonna be adjusting with each other. I feel you need to adjust with this person because this person is someone that doesn't want to wait and is very quick and keeps on evolving and are unpredictable. So I feel like here there's one person that will be adjusting that is you Gemini but I feel like this is worth it because this person is someone that's very inspiring, protecting at the time of need and extremely loving and caring and giving. That's what you want. So I'm seeing after a lot of patience, you'll see your dreams getting fulfilled. You can see those expectations turning into reality, things changing and treasure opening up for you. Okay, Gemini, please. The justice, what you deserve is what you will be getting in this month of 2023, in this sorry, year of 2023, I feel like it's going to start from January onwards. You'll start to see results. The best part is you guys are pretty opposite from each other. I feel your person could be a fire sign or an Aries or a, even Libra for some of you. But I feel like your person is someone that might be more older or more mature and experienced that I've told you. But it's more like about you, Gemini, that you are going to stay very focused and detached from anyone that comes into your life. Even if this person comes and shows a lot of love, you're still staying detached and that's the best way to go. Because if you open up your heart and become all easy, breezy, then the thrill, the excitement goes away. I don't know why, but the person stops chasing for no reason. So you understand that and you know how to you know, deal with someone psychologically so you are going to be well placed well mannered extremely strong headed and focused you'll have the bird's eye view when it comes to this is my goal this is what i want for some of you gemini you are actually setting a goal to find the love of your life and ending up settling down with them for some okay for most of you i'm seeing you're setting a goal to achieve you know something that's impossible but you know that it's reachable it's not like you can't do it you believe in yourself and i feel like you're totally goal oriented these days there's some goal that you're setting in this year and you will be achieving it with focus and intention I don't want to say hate, but I feel like your person may find you a little cold and distant initially. And I think that's the trait that they will get attracted to of yours. I'm also seeing something to do with hairstyling. Maybe you're a hairstylist or you might get your hair done in a different style. Okay, in 2023. Two of materials. You might gain money from different sources. It's not just from your job, but I feel like you may earn money from different, different sources or you may have to try or you will be, you you know, you will be juggling between professional and personal life, but you will know how to manage the two. You will be pretty much at balance when it comes to two different things, okay, that you're doing. So, yeah, I'm seeing you're balancing your life really well in 2023. Even your health is on point. You're taking care of your eating habits is also what I'm seeing. The color red is going to mesmerize you. I don't know why, but I feel like you're wearing more red, like lip, uh, lipstick. If you're a female watching this, or your person will be wearing more red and you'll get attracted to them. Nine, the hermit. I feel like you'll become more mature. Gemini, you'll see yourself as not very outgoing and not looking for peace and love or validation from outside you're rather going inside and finding out the best potential and 
bringing it out i feel you're learning something new you're diving into deep knowledge about your field you're improvising your skills and you know that there's not light outside but there's light within i always always believe this fact and everybody knows this fact as well that the universe is inside of us and it's not really outside so whatever we are looking for it's already inside of us we don't really need to go out and discover and look for it and find validation otherwise we'll end up just killing ourselves like our moods you know our feelings so is it draining ourselves and not being who we are for the person we are so here i'm seeing you are very much in tune with your inner self and your awakened self is like uh alive and you're you're you know working on your on your goals and your potential it doesn't matter how people see you you want to be seen as good you want to be seen as successful for yourself so it's more like learning and being within your zone and also i'm seeing you being more of an introvert okay for some of you might be dealing with a Virgo interested in you but it's more like you have lots going on and you can do things on your own. You don't really rely on others to help you come and help you. Although your person will be really helpful towards you. I'm also seeing you making money such that you might be buying expensive stuff as well. <clears throat> A lot of fishes in the sea. I'm seeing this might bore you as well, Gemini, because you i have told you like by 20 till 2022 you had options and you were like okay not the one not the one and not the one so you understood that this is like an, a never-ending game so why do you just even waste your time on dating and seeing dating and seeing dating and seeing so you will have options but nothing of these is going to excite you you'll be very much focused inside of yourself and your own potential bringing out the best of you Somehow you'll meet the one that might be older than you that's going to like kind of join you in your pursuit and be supportive. And that's the person you'll be falling for. I'm not seeing them as being very uh, handsome or beautiful, but I'm definitely seeing them bossy and intimidating. So the eight of voices, you might be cutting down on the options that you're still talking to Gemini. You don't really want to waste your energy on people. That's something that I'm seeing. Okay. Queen of inspiration. You're like, don't bug me. I don't, I just want to focus on my life. I just want to focus on my goals. I just want to focus on my passions and my artistic skills. I feel you're going to bring up the best inside of you. Gemini, it's like you're flying, okay, high, soaring high, and I feel you're <clears throat> clearing your exams even with the um, flying colors. It's like every time you're getting appreciation for whatever you're doing. So it's like you're not even looking at options. You're not even bothered, okay? You're more focused on yourself. 2023 is about self-love more. Gemini, please. Queen of materials this is who you will be you will be this i feel you're also taking care of your appearance and at the same time you're also taking care of your money i'm seeing through your appearance may come money for some of you might be influencers might be into uh, styling or might be into designing you know whatever it is i feel something to do with beauty that makes that helps you make money so i feel like is like the next innings of your life or is like a new phase where you found your potential and you're working on it and you're gaining power and there's a lot of stability with it coming in and i'm also seeing money coming in so it's like a win-win situation whatever you do it's going to end up working out for you you're going to be feeling like a boss every time <clears throat> Six of emotions. Oh my gosh. Someone from the past might miss you and may try to get your attention by doing nasty things. But this won't bother you. I feel there's someone that is like trying to find peace because you're not there in their life anymore. Who is this person? It could be a Scorpio. 
news or voices i feel there's someone that's been obsessively thinking about you in 2023 you'll definitely have your past missing you like anything but you won't be bothered you'd not want to go back and you'd not want to like even look at them so this makes them go crazy and they might do some nasty things to get your attention but that's just only going to you know irk you and push you away okay occupation so this is your major goal for this 2023 some of you 34 here but i'm seeing your major goal is all about winning hearts of people uh through your work okay that's what i'm seeing here pathway you have a long way to go guys and this from 34 to 35 i'm definitely seeing you will be evolving you'll be getting better in your work your skills are going to be polished coffin something you're going to put an end to okay something you're going to put an end to okay maybe it's love of your life it's a person that you really cared about and you're going to put an end to it or you're going to put an end to your singledom and you will be ending up getting married and then having a beautiful dating period starting there's a new beginning happening i'm feeling you're no more like i'm also seeing uh, with 2023, the coming time, you will start to balance your life because I think you have been like that, very focused in your career from day one. But in 2023, you will learn to manage to do two things, the love aspect and the career aspect of your life where you will be balancing both the things and you will also be dating at the same time just one specific person I was telling you about. Any channel messages someone wants to send to Gemini in 2023? Let's see. Yeah, there's someone that still thinks about you at night, late night, okay, cannot get over you. Gemini, please. There it is, deep knowing. You know exactly what's going on around you. You're a heavy psychic. I feel like, Gemini, you had that kind of uh, energy inside of you where you know what's going on behind your back. You know who's thinking about you. You know what you want to do in your life. So whatever you're doing, you already know that this is right for you. So there's no point of uh, uh, doubt or there's no need of going back and figuring out things once again. You don't need that. You just move forward. Anything about your new love, please? Oh, this is your soulmate because the king and queen of pentacles is like you both might meet on the same page. Um, maybe you guys will be meeting through work-related situation, professional meeting. But this person is already very successful and you're also reaching that level. But I'm seeing this could be someone that's older. But I'm definitely seeing this is someone that you might work with as well. But I'm seeing uh, this is someone that is on a higher status and looking for a grounded relationship. The star, when they see you, you might be in public eye, Gemini, and if it's not you, your person is definitely. So someone might find uh, someone on social media as well. This could be an Aquarius for some of you, Gemini. But I feel when they see you, they'll be like, oh my gosh, oh my God. You're going to make this person feel so emotional for you. They're not the one to feel emotional over things, over people on any basis because this person has everything that they want. And they're more money-minded. But with you, they're like, there's some, something you've done to this person that they'll learn to love. And they'll be more open emotionally. So I feel like you're going to open this emotional center of this person. Okay. I think that center is called RAS. R-A-S. Maybe. So that's the center you're going to open up in this person's mind. It's going to make them know what love is and how to fall in love and i feel you are someone that will be extremely special for this person okay they're gonna get emotional for you as well you will be very difficult to tackle as well for this person that like that because you're in your own world doing your own thing gemini you don't give a damn codependency any kind of addictions cut down on it or your person's going to be hell addicted towards you. And they, when they see you, they talk to you. They'll open up their heart to you. And you will realize, okay, this is the one. I feel there's an age difference for some of you. You guys, this is your childhood friend. And then we have this. Okay, this person may be older, may have kids from the past. That might not go well with you. That might be very, very specific. So try to get 
um, you know, try to get to know about their background before actually diving into this, okay? Because I feel like certain things must be clear beforehand so that you can move smooth in the relationship. <clears throat> they might not tell you this thing that they have kids or something about their past that you really need to know. So there's a new romantic situation with this person that is arising, okay? They are very romantic feel like your person is extremely romantic when it comes to you see someone with good build male or female doesn't matter i'm definitely seeing this person is extremely caring and protective towards you and your happiness and they mean it that my gemini needs to be happy and i'm there to support them to be there for them protect them you know like that don't let your past hold you back. If you're still expecting someone from the past reaching out, they will reach out, but you won't be the same again. So don't hold yourself back. Move forward. You're a different person. There's a fear of losing someone or something, which I don't think is actually um, real in the physical world. You're just making it all up. So let go of all the fears. You guys, whatever you do, whatever you, you know, uh, Gemini, whatever you've been doing or you will do, you will be highly appreciated. It's like you will inspire people, especially this person. They're going to appreciate you with flowers. They're going to compliment you. You might also change your style as well, I'm seeing. More than speaking, it's a good ear for you to just sit back, relax and listen because your intuition will talk to you a lot. I'm seeing amethyst will be really helpful for you soulmate so you're about to meet this person or the, they're about to open up in love with you gemini anything else for my gems be gentle with yourself you might need a rhodochrosite so you can get it from me as well but i feel yes you need a rhodochrosite to keep loving yourself throughout in which you do already now i'm gonna do an all sign read we're gonna end it with that So many cards. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Aries towards Gemini. We'll be in two minds, we'll try to win you, but we'll have their head somewhere else as well. Or this is someone that you're about to meet when you're already dealing with someone. Taurus. Taurus is looking for deep commitment. They think you're worth it and you're a uh, marriage material. The Gemini might downright propose you, okay? The Cancer may put... Uh, I feel a like cancer is very conflicting because they all always have insecurities of you doing better than them. Then we have Leo who's going to want to take things forward towards deep commitment. And then we have Virgo. Virgo might end this, okay, because they feel like a failure in front of you. Libra wants a solid foundation being laid. Scorpio wants to give this a chance, but I feel like the Scorpio is taking it too easy, Sagittarius is right now wanting to work things out, but they're too slow in action. I'm also saying they're very careful about not ruining everything. And then we have Capricorn. Capricorn is, I feel like if this is a past person, they want to they want to reconcile, they want to heal this, everything. But if this is a new person, they're still dealing with someone and they're still coming out of it. So it will be tough. Aquarius wants to put a lot of work into this connection to have you in their arms. Pisces is very happy to have known you and I feel they don't know how the future would be like but they really want to live present moment with you. Okay. We're going to be doing chance. Mm -hmm. All right. Strong Libra energy is there. Pisces energy is there. What else? Codependency. Again, you guys, you stay detached or if you're attached to someone, get out of it. 
I'm also seeing if you're not attached to anyone and there's someone new coming in, they will be extremely codependent on you guys. Might work together, everything together. This person wants you to be a part of their life in terms of profession, everything. Um, your person may have these letters in their name or they're telling you something about your life. So you can just pretty much find out how, okay? Queen and king or whatever. Okay. Um, come out of this comfort zone. That's what I just said. Let's do one domino. Three and two. Okay. So this is trying to say... Fortunate changes might come. I'm seeing a lot of money is coming, but you have to be careful while um, following your way, okay, towards um, financial matters because you might overspend or you might put your money in the wrong place. You might invest in the wrong place. So you will have a lot of money, fortune coming in, but take care of how you're working out with your finances okay so that's about it gemini i hope you've enjoyed the read don't forget to like subscribe and comment down below let me know how this resonated i'll see you again bye